Are you in the mood for some hilarious messing up of lines? How about people tripping and falling straight on their face? Maybe you'd like to see all the goody dancing a show can offer? Well, in that case, here are the sex education funniest bloopers from all seasons. Let's dive right into it, shall we? Number 30. Okay, did something happen between these two on the set? Because Jillian was way too serious even though this was obviously a blooper. And why was the guy playing the delivery man so serious? Firmly at the root. Okay. Number 29. Break it down. A dance session when you're bored is always welcome, but we're just surprised the principal was being just as goofy as the teenage actors. Hey, it looks like his job's been taking a toll on him. Number 28. Here's why we don't advise bringing wild animals on the set. Sooner or later, they're gonna start freaking out, and you better pray that they're as far away from you as possible when they do. In Lou's case, the iguana was right on her arm. When it started freaking out, they immediately called for a tamer. Number 27. Okay, what in the world did she just do? That sounded like an animal mating call to us. Number 26. We have to be honest, Emma and Amy Liu improvising a police interrogation is something else. Amy got really carried away with her character. We think she was going for a New York cop with an Italian accent. If that was the case, then spot on Amy. Just loosen up a bit. We finally got you, eh? So what's it gonna be? You gonna fuss up? <laughs> if you liked our first five picks, don't forget to smash that like button. It keeps the almighty YouTube algorithm happy. And you keep getting these videos for free. Number 25. Well, even though Jillian Anderson is an experienced actress with years of acting under her belt, she still has a problem remembering lines. And we get it, sometimes your mind drifts off and you keep thinking about the Bahamas and the beautiful beaches, the azure blue water, and the… wait. What are we talking about again? Oh right, Jillian Anderson forgetting her lines. So Tim, when Clara tells you that she thinks she doesn't want you to have what the fuck am I saying? Number 24. And if you thought Jillian forgot her lines, take a look at these two. When they forgot their lines, they did this. Whatever kind of shamanic, ritualistic dance that was. Number 23. Okay, Jillian is obviously the polar opposite of her character on the show. We would never have imagined that the scene where Dr. Jean got drunk would be even funnier behind the scenes. Piggyback ride, anyone? Number 22. Hey, don't worry, Miss Anderson. Many guys can't find it either. To be honest, now the most pleasant shot in the movie? Yeah, awkward alert. Number 21. Is someone up for a shower? Shower anyone? Well, never mind. We're gonna give you one anyways. It might have been cold, it might have caught the actors off guard, but it sure was funny. And if you ask us, this is blooper real gold. Well, if you thought that was crazy, wait till you see what Acid did in the next clip. Number 20. Okay, we have the word chinchillas and, um, what's the least sexual way to say this? Oral stimulation of the phallus? Yeah, that doesn't sound posh at all. Anyways, actor Asa Butterfield got into trouble for using them in the same sentence, and it was so wrong that even he forgot what he was supposed to say. I might have said something about giving chinchillas blowjobs. Uh, wait, that's not right. <laughs> but chinchillas giving blowjobs. <laughs> Number 19. Okay, from the moment we saw these two dudes passing the football, we knew that there was going to be trouble. And sure enough, here comes Asa running down the hall, the ball hits him, and he falls down the stairs. Luckily, he was okay, but one of the crew members ran to check if he was okay. Number 18. Oh god, we're just glad there wasn't a baby inside that stroller. And we're just curious, what gave Asa the confidence to say, I'm gonna jump over this baby stroller while going down a flight of stairs? It's no wonder his co-star couldn't keep it together. Someone's... <laughs> Number 17. Hey, we already told you that the actor that plays the principal couldn't be further away from the character he plays on set. Here, you can see him messing with one of the extras. The kid blocked him first, but then he blocked him later. Number 16. No, Dr. Milburn, he wasn't paying kids at school for sex. He was being paid by kids from school for sex advice. You see, it's all about the nuances, people. All it takes is a few word changes, and the sentence gets a totally different meaning. Have you been paying students at school for sex? Oh, <laughs> Number 15. 
Whoever thought that would be sexy has never tried doing it in front of a real person. And can you blame Nkuti for not being able to hold it in while his co-star was doing whatever he was trying to do with that snack? It looks so wrong and not in a naughty way. It's just wrong. Number 14. Will she trip or will she bump into Emma? And bumping it is. Of course, she couldn't continue with the scene. How do you keep a straight face after that? Number 13. Dr. Milburn. You should know better than to go around the house knocking over lamps. But it was sure funny to see her sweat as she was trying to save them. It just shows you she cares for the set. Number 12. Okay, I know his reaction is funny, but not washing your hands because you didn't go number two is not a real reason. Just stop being gross and wash them. It takes a few seconds and people won't have a problem shaking your hands. You should wash your hands. I didn't do a poo. <laughs> I was crying. Number 11. Well, no wonder Miley Cyrus did a music video with a sledgehammer. Those things bring out the savage in all of us. Case in point. Yes! 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 Number 10. Okay, you know those cliche cartoons where the main character gets handed a huge load of books when he joins school and their arms fall off from the torso from the weight of the books? Well, something similar happened here and it took them several shots to get it just right. Like, you can make one tree from those books. <laughs> Number 9. I'm gonna be really close if Connor's on his mark. And then Connor does this immediately after. More than a little close, wouldn't you say? Number 8. Okay, we get it that dreams are dreams, but please stop it. The word has already lost all meaning. Dreams, dreams, mm, nope. Now it just sounds weird. Thanks, man. Dreams are dreams. Dreams are dreams, 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 dreams. <laughs> Dreams. <laughs> Dreams. Good. Number 7. Well, season 2 had their own dance blooper reel, which we just had to include on this list. Hands down, and Cutie's the best at these. Number 6. Yeah, trying to improvise dirty talk never goes well. Either you're really good at it, or you're awful. We found that there's no in between, to be honest. But maybe this actor was terrified by the sergeant who was yelling at him. Er, we mean sweet little girl. Dog, woman, dog! A hound of the woman kind. <laughs> Number 5. And of course, all of those smooth flirting scenes you see on the show didn't always go as planned. Sometimes you have an object falling for no apparent reason. Yeah, try being smooth while you have that happening in the background. Some of these are quite good. <laughs> Number 4. Well, that was uncalled for, but funny as all hell. Even Asa and Emma couldn't keep it together after Nkuti screamed, Satan, when Butterfield slammed the door of his locker. Oh, man. Satan! <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Number 3. There's shy kissing, there's sloppy kissing, there's gross kissing, and then there's this type of kissing. Now, we don't know what they were trying to do, but how they managed to not break character for so long is beyond us. We feel wrong just watching this. Number 2. Well, they must have one sexy beast working the camera because Amy Lou Wood just couldn't stop winking at him. Either that or she was winking at a reflection in the camera lens. Number 1. And here's Colin Hendricks pissed behind the scenes of the play. He even cursed at one of the actors. At that point, Nkuti lost it and burst out laughing. On a related note, which of these bloopers did you think was the funniest? You can tell us in the comment section below. If you'd like to see more videos like these, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of them. And as always, thanks for watching, guys.